Renee here and I am back with another video. All right guys, so today we are at Papa John's and Papa John's is having like a bacon mania moment. You feel me? But they just going crazy with the bacon. So if you're interested, stay tuned because we're about to get right into the video. Now, if you know me, then you know that I love bacon. I do, I do, I do, ooh. Okay, I already went inside because it just be a hassle and rassle sometimes. And it was a lot going on. I wasn't able to get much footage, but I did get the goods. So I got the papadilla and then I also wanted to try their bacon jalapenos with cream cheese. Oh my God. I'm hungry. Let me get y'all closer. Let's start with our smoked bacon papadilla with the parmesan, okay? Okay, I see the part and it smells good. Yes. I see that parmesan crust right here. Let's open this thing up and see what it's talking about on the inside. That's a huge strip of bacon right there. So I see we got regular bacon and we got Canadian bacon. I see, of course, some more cheese. I think it got ranch on it, onions and stuff. I don't really see much of anything else, but I will know when I bite into it. Let's look at these jalapeno poppers. All right, so here go the bacon jalapeno poppers. Come on, is y'all popping or what? Oh, I do see that bacon though. And that cream cheese with a jalapeno. Oh, there go a little jalapeno. Hey, girl. All right. Oh, it's all stove. Yes. Come on, Let's come start on. start with these bacon jalapeno poppers. You know, I got me some spicy garlic here. Y'all know Papa John's is known for their garlic. This is my first time ever trying the spicy garlic. Excited is an understatement. You hear me? What's a good one? What's a good one? This one, all right. Let's go with this one. Dip it in some of that good old garlic sauce. Mmm. No, she she wasn't ready. Wait. So, it's the cream cheese for me. Y'all, yeah. these joints crack. First of all, let's get right into it. We ain't about to waste no time. So delicate and so bread tasted fresh, okay? It was giving freshness, okay? Delicate and brand new. Then you bite into that cream cheese, but the way that jalapeno come in, oh, uh, seems like you're ready. The way it showed up and showed out like that, oh my God, and then the bacon. Baby, the bacon was just like the cherry on top. It didn't need the bacon, but I was so happy it was there. It took it to the next, hold on, wait a minute, because it really took it up a notch, you hear me? Woo, my taste buds are still sizzling. Oh, spicy, spicy. Yeah, I like that. Ooh, like a little pillow. Full of your hopes and dreams. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, look at this bacon that's trying to escape. Put that right there. No bacon left behind. Not on my watch. Oh my God. Why I ain't never had that jalapeno poppers before? Why ain't nobody tell me the jalapeno poppers was popping like that? Hold on, let me drink some water. Ooh, gotta kill my palate. Now, let's get into this papadilla. Papadilla, can't wait, so glad to meet you. Yes, crust. Now I know this was supposed to come with ranch and they ain't give me no ranch, but it's fine. I ain't gonna trip about it. I'm gonna take a bite. Forget all that. Mm. Papa John's. I know we don't meet like this often, but I am so glad that when we do, you gonna keep it a honey with me. Baby, this thing is bomb. But well, let me dip it in some of the garlic. I don't want no ranch on it, to be honest. Mmm. 
Now hold on. Hold on. You ever eat something so good and it just got you on your head itching a little bit like, mmm, that Parmesan crust though? Needed it. Didn't know I needed, got it. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? We appreciate that moment. It's packed with bacon. They not sleeping on the bacon moment. You got regular strips that's nice and crispy. <clears throat> not fried hard, medium well, over easy type moment. You know what I'm saying? Got a nice little crunch on the back end. Then you got that Canadian bacon. You know what I'm saying? Canadian bacon kind of give you like ham. But it don't taste like ham, but it give you ham, you know? I'm a girl that loves onions. You got the sauteed onions and you got that rain sauce on there. Then you dip it in that spicy garlic sauce like that. Who sent you? I need to send out some thank you notes. This thing is hitting. This is all right with me, but you got to like bacon. If you don't, you honestly probably would think I'm crazy. Hmm. And you know I'm not a crust girl. I don't really like crust, but I'm going to try the crust. You know, you know what I'm saying? What's going on the crust? The crust are like, it's thin crust, so it ain't bothering nobody, honestly. Baby, when they said bacon mania, they was not playing. You know, I also like the fact they didn't overstuff it. Trust me when I tell you, this is just enough topping. You can eat this cute too, if you wanted to. I don't think I'm eating cute, but if you wanted to eat it cute, like one of these moments. I got you. Okay, keep it cute or put it on mute. You don't got pizza sauce going everywhere. Your hands are still fairly clean. I like this. You know, I do have a question though. Is Papadia short for like folding two pieces, two slices of pizza in half? Is that what that means? Like, is that what that means? What is, what do it mean? Cause this do give me like two slices of pizza kind of just folded in half. Sometimes I mean, no. either way it's good. I ain't hating. I'm just trying to figure out, you know, is there another word for fold two and half? That's it right there. And then you don't feel like you over ate. Because sometimes you can eat pizza and feel like, ooh, oh my God, this much. You know? You know that feeling. But with this, I still feel very slim. So that's good. I like that. I like that. Well, look, if you haven't already, Go to Papa John's and try out their bacon mania. They put a little bit more love in the food, and I ain't mad at it. You know, I can feel the love on this end. Thank you for that, Papa. I appreciate you. I love it when they call me Big Papa. Throw your hands in the air if you's a true player from the Himalaya. Yeah. Anyway, guys, I am about to head out. But before I do, keep in mind that you can't please everybody. <laughs> okay everybody ain't gonna like you and everybody ain't gonna like what you do okay everybody not gonna like what you got going on but that's okay don't settle there don't get stuck there don't get caught up in trying to people please because then you're gonna run yourself ragged trying to do stuff that matters to others and that don't matter at all to you so who is more important is what i want for me more important or what you think i should want more important Baby, the math is mathing on this end. I know exactly what the answer is. Do you? Everybody gonna have their preference and you ain't gonna be everybody cup of tea. But that's why they came up with other brands. Girl, go and try something else out there. Hell, I'ma still be here regardless anyway. I said all of that to say, stay true to you, baby. Because if you like it, then I love it. All right now. Okay, well, if you like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, hit that notification bell so you'll know everything. Time upload. Until next time, guys. Peace.